Okay, here we are out in the furniture shop, aka garage. We've had this uh, furniture in here for uh, a little over a year, and we're finally getting around to uh, getting it all cleaned up and ready to spray. Uh, some of it's going to Miss Kimmy, and some of it's going to Whitney, and whomever else. Uh, not sure where this, uh, this is a bedroom set here that we had. Oh, by the way, we have a little heating friend over here. Since it's about 30 degrees outside, got a little crack in the garage door there so we don't asphyxiate ourselves. And I got my, uh, my helper here who's trying to work off a little bit of an overdraft at the bank. Got the statement today, didn't have any more money, so he's trying to earn a little bit to uh, cover, cover the bank. What happened? Hold it. You can't put it on the ground? So as long as we don't have to spend more energy and supervision than it's worth, we'll uh, let this continue to go. So far it's been pretty good. So anyway, uh, this is the cleaning phase. We've got everything uh, glued up kind of where it needed to be, where it got, needed to be fixed and a little bit of uh, uh, wood putty in places and a couple last minute little things here to glue some veneers back together and then we'll uh, we're just washing it now to get it all clean and then we're gonna maybe start spray painting tomorrow. So we'll just fill you in on that little job when we get there. Good morning. Um, we're back here at the paint shop this morning. Uh, got everything primed. So we got, uh, got all the dressers and the drawers and everything's primed up and got some new paint uh, for the final coat. So we're gonna get these things wrapped up today. In the meantime, we're going to have to deal with a little snow. I don't know if you can see it or not out there. There's some snow out there today, uh, three or four inches, I guess, something like that. So we'll get that uh, taken care of during the course of the day also and waiting for the, uh, my heater friend over there to get things heated up for me a little bit. And uh, we'll be ready to go here a little bit. So we'll keep you posted. Paint this up. This is a five drawer chest here. Uh, got some pieces already finished there, a bunch of drawers over there. So we're getting ready to hit her again. A little bit of a break. And we're ready to go here. So we'll, uh, we'll paint this up a little bit. Okay, we've got our one last piece here to do. This one's primed. Uh, this is Miss Kimmy's. She's going to put this upstairs somewhere, I think. So uh, we have all the others over there painted, but I got them covered up because this is a slightly different color, a bit darker. Miss Kimmy's special Ethan Allen look-alike paint, I guess. Um, anyway, so we're going to paint it that color. It matches some of the other stuff that she has. 
and I uh, didn't want to have any of the overspray get on the other, so we covered it up. And uh, we're going to knock this one out and be done. Okay, we're getting pretty well to being done here, I think. Um, kind of letting this dry, and then we'll look for any spots we might have missed. Uh, I'm having a beer, so I've a little bit of completion here. Anyway, uh, it's looking pretty good. Uh, as I mentioned earlier, I've got the other stuff we did yesterday is over there covered up and it's uh, slightly different color than this and I didn't want it to be overspray to, to get over there. So now all we've got to do is uh, put the hardware on and we'll put the back back on. I took the back off of this one uh, because it was... Uh, the doors on the side of this one don't open and it's really tough to get into the uh, behind there to get those, so I took the back off. The other one we did here last year, this Kimmy uh, got a little creative and decided to paint the back a slightly different color, and uh, that's the one that's in in by the uh, in the kitchen, and she put, painted it green, but this one she just wanted it the same color, so. But I took it off, and uh, we'll put that back on, staple it up, and then put the hardware on and the glass in, and, uh, and we'll be good to go. So finally we're going to be able to get all this stuff out of here and then figure out what the next uh, little project is. Um, we'll uh, get after that one. Anyway, a uh, little cool out today. Got about four inches of snow yesterday, I guess it was. And uh, um, so we'll have the heater on here. Got it up to about... Uh, 55 degrees, turn the heater off, and it's kind of holding there steady, so uh, we're going to wrap this up. I think we're headed to the uh, to the mall here this afternoon, and uh, let's see what's going on out there. I think Chase has got an appointment at the, uh, at the Apple store, so he needs to go get his iPod fixed or tuned up or something. All right, anyway, so we'll uh, keep you posted. Bye. Good morning. Um, we're gonna just do a little wrap up here. Uh, this is the kind of the finished product. These are getting ready to head over to Whitney's uh, this afternoon. A uh, little bedroom set, uh, tall boy there, a dresser and uh, two little nightstands. So they turned out pretty darn good actually. Um, I'll try to uh, put a few before pictures in here, but um, anyway, these turned out pretty good. So we'll uh, take in the house. The other two pieces are in the house. Uh, somewhat staged, but uh, we'll go take a look at those. So here's the other one here. I guess this is going to be the uh, the family gallery uh, cabinet. Miss Kimmy hasn't got it fully staged yet, but it turned out pretty nice as well. Um, except I think the, the poles are upside down. Might have to check that and see what the story is there, but that's easy fix. Anyway, we'll go take a look at the other piece that's uh, staged up downstairs. So this is uh, this piece here. Actually, is a real piece of junk. To be honest, it's uh, probably not worth the paint that it, that we took to paint it. But anyway, it turned out pretty good. Uh, still got to put uh, some poles on it. Those aren't done yet. But this is kind of going to be the uh, uh, the nostalgia cabinet, I guess. And all of Kim's old books and some old toys, and uh, either mine or. Bob's old Lionel train there, not sure. That's all that's left of it. Um, but anyway, that turned out pretty good too. Um, so as soon as we get some handles, the old hardware we chose not to put on that one because it was uh, not, uh, not too good actually. So we're going to get some new poles and uh, finish that one up. Anyway, that was, that's kind of the, uh, got that project wrapped up. Uh, the boss now says we're moving to one of the bedrooms to uh, do some wainscoting as the next project. So we'll uh, update you when we start that and uh, keep you posted.